the revenue recognition criteria. The first one is the from the firm side, the firm should deliver the products and uh, perform their service. The other is the firm should be able to receive the assets or settled on a liability. In the prior example, we assume the cash receipts or assets receipts are guaranteed, but sometimes the cash collectability is uncertain. That means it may result in the failure for a firm to fulfill the second criterion for the revenue recognition. If this is the case, the firm must delay the revenue recognition. So there are two different methods. One is installment methods. The other is cost recover method. So if sales price is 100, cost is 60, payment is $20 each month. So each month the firms recognize $20 revenue and 12 expenses. So the margin is 8 per month. So the gross margin 8 divided by 20 is the same as 100 subtract 60 divided by 100. Cost recovery method. So when the firm receives the payment, it should first to cover its cost first. Okay. So if the firm received $20, it should recognize expense first. Then after all the expenses are covered, then the firm recognize the profit margin. So the first year, revenue is 20, expense is 20, margin is zero. Second, 20, 20, zero. Third, 20, 20, zero. Okay, all the 60 expenses are recognized. So fourth year, 20, subtract zero is 20. Fifth year is 20, subtract zero is another 20. So because the cash receipts is uncertain, so it should defer their profits until all their expenses are covered.